I hear a lot of the time, be careful. Be careful, young brother. Be careful, Bob. Be safe. You know, hey, man, be careful, man. They're going to get you, man. How can you talk about all this stuff, man? Let me tell y'all something. I don't think you understand. This is an illusion. They don't give a fuck how many conspiracies you talk about. They don't care if you uh, riot in the street. They don't care if you riot on Instagram. They don't give a fuck. They're here to program your subconscious mind. How do you program the subconscious mind? Trauma. Repetition. Symbols. Those are the three ways to program the subconscious mind. And from there, the subconscious mind simply produces what it thinks is real. So what do you think is real? My brother? What do you think is real? All of the ancient texts talk about this. They say the world is an illusion. And you think they you think it's a metaphor. Don't get rocked to sleep. What now. is the ancient art of commit? Kimmit. Kimmit. Commit. Whatever y'all niggas like. Whichever y'all prefer. What's the ancient art? Alchemy. Becoming God through alchemy. Illumination through putrefaction. Niggas need to know your shit. Y'all niggas walking around here with these unks. Niggas walking around here with these eyes. Walking around here with the eye of horse and shit. Niggas don't even know your shit. Now some people speak out against sex. Let me tell you something. In the beginning there was one. The one God. Which God is a German deity. It's not even really what it is. But the mind of the Most High split himself into two. The lingam and the yoni. When they combine, God then knows himself. The divine feminine and the divine masculine. You talk about you want to go vegan and be, you know, you want to be tip top shape. But you don't know about Tantra? You don't know about your Kundalini and your pineal gland and your chakras? You don't know how your subconscious mind works? It's all an ecosystem. Now, you know, everybody don't understand. Everybody don't get it. But you got to understand also the people that don't get it are really your shield. And they're really blocking. They're really, they like the infantry. They go in first so that you can do what you need to do. And sometimes they, they ain't going to understand. And they're going to fight and they're going to get angry. But, but in these moments is when you need to be delicate. Because they're channeling something. They don't even know it. They don't even realize it. So everything serves its purpose. We all getting through the dough. Everybody going to get through the dough. But somebody got to hold the dough open. This is not the real you. So if this is an illusion and we say that you sleep. That means the real you is sleep. The real you is sleep. And you only go there when you go to sleep. Because this is the American That's dream. That's what you did. But when it comes to America, we feel like we immune to that shit. Even the Illuminati, the 13 bloodlines that run the world. Look up. This is not even no theory, y'all. This You can look up the 25 banks that own ev everything. Nigga, everything? Nigga, everything. And, you know, we feel like we're doing something because, you know, we find out, you know, who Rockefeller is and, you know, we find out who the Rothschilds are. And we like, man, figured it out. No. All them are just puppets. You think the government and the politicians are puppets? Well, even the Illuminati is puppets. It's something much darker behind all it of that It doesn't matter if somebody calls you crazy. It really doesn't. At this point, the shit that's finna happen... The shit that they finna do? You think people calling you crazy is the worst that could happen? You got you got two different types of people. You know, you got the people that are like, you know, that doesn't make sense. Like, explain that to me. You got people like that. Don't turn those people away. And then you got some people that are just like, this is stupid, you fucking idiot. This is dumb. Like, don't even don't even smack them people. Like, it's a waste of time. They're they're angry because they can't even express themselves. They don't have the vocabulary or the knowledge to express themselves. If you let yourself become entangled with those people, then you're just letting the same negative parasitic entity feed off of your energy and siphon off your energy that's using them. With trolls, like, fuck the trolls. But the people who have real questions and really want to understand it, then, you know, have a conversation. There's something behind that. Something that's been going on and is finally being disclosed. It's coming out. That's why all these people is trying to get this information out about the pedo gate, all this information coming out about the sex trafficking, the organ, organ trafficking. We in the time of disclosure. Everybody is risking their lives to put this information out just to, just to 
get a tiny bit of y'all. The the shift is happening. And it ain't gonna be pretty. It is not gonna be pretty. You dig what I'm saying? But it's gotta get ugly. It's like cleaning out your house. You gotta get all that shit from under the under the stove, under the dresser, under the fridge. You gotta see you gotta see that shit. You gotta clean that shit out. And that's what's happening. The disclosure. <laughs> 